Hello and welcome to Big Orbit Games unboxing video of the new Weishwart set Love Live Volume 2 School Idol Project. My name is Simon and I will be doing the unboxing today. So I'm just going to open this up. We're going to go through each booster and have a look and see what we get. Now I'm not going to proclaim I am some kind of Weishwart's master. Far from it. I enjoy playing it. I enjoy playing most card games. Um, oh, that's our box topper by the way. Dancing Stars on me, Nico Yazawa. Um, kind of cool. Oh, we've got that one. That's nice. Oh, sorry. There's more than one in these ones, isn't there? So, let's open that up and have a look at the other ones as well. Just so you can see everything I get. But as I say, I'm not an expert on my charts. I enjoy playing the game. And so, a lot of this we're just going to sort of brush through. Um, I'm not going to go into great detail over every card. So, Dancing Stars and Me Nozomi. And Dancing Stars and Me Ellie. So, we got some of them. Uh, also, underneath here is a. Um, I'm going to hide the code. <laughs> we have in this pack we have codes for the game, the School Idol Festival rhythm match, uh, rhythm based game, which is very fun and addictive if you're into those kinds of games, which I uh, am a little bit. So let's get some of the packs out. So yep, yeah, let's get the packs out. So it's beautiful pink and blue colour on this. <laughs> so let's. So we have um, Door to Our Dreams as our first card. Door to Our Dreams and Zomi Tojo. Uh, level one, five thousand power. Auto when it's placed on stage from hand. If you have another character in Zomi in its card, then this card gets plus two thousand power to the end of turn. If you're unfamiliar with um, a lot of Love Life decks. They tend to be sort of semi waifu decks. You tend to focus on one character in particular. So it's cool to see some of the cards with abilities that do only pertain to the characters of the same name. And then we have Huge Rice Ball Haneo, Innocent Orisa, Snow Halation. Oh, that's a cool name. Uh, Snow Halation Maki, Gentle Smile Umi. We have the Real Showdown Nico. Then our first rare is Forever and Ever Maki. So it's a level 0, 4000 power, which is quite high for level 0. Auto, when this card is placed on stage from hand, put the top two cards of your deck into your waiting room. If there was a climax amongst those cards, though, rest this card. So there is a bit of a downside to playing such a powerful 0, which is the um, potential for resting. But it does give you some salvaging uh, targets. So, and then our climax was looking back at memories, which is uh, all characters get plus two soul with a double soul trigger. So, oh, let's keep those separate. Yeah, I played through uh, the 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 app, but I've never been a huge Love Life fan. So, if anyone wants to educate me more on this, then please feel free to in the comments. So we have Memories of Live, Rin, Invitation to School, Sabasa, the Nico Pri, Way of the Maiden, Nico, Snow Halation, Door to Our Dreams, Maki, Golden Rice Temptation, and then oh, our rare for the pack is the Kira Kira Sensation, Kutari. So it's another level zero, 1,500 power. Continuous, the character facing this card cannot move to another position on the stage. That's an interesting ability. And also, when this card becomes reversed, if the card's battle opponent is level 0 or lower, you may reverse that character. So it's a reverser, which is cool. And then we have Naptime Umi. Yeah, having reverses is very useful for the uh, for that early game. So, Memories of Life, Haneo. Invitation to School. Full of smiles, startling fact, Hanukkah, tea time, Nozomi, image change, Hanukkah, and then we have another single rare, Kira Kira Sensation, ah, oh, we've got the other one, uh, one of the other ones, sorry, uh, Hanio Koizumi, uh, apologise if I'm badly pronouncing these, so it's a level 2, so it's nice to see a different level, cost of stock to play, 7,500 power, which is a respectable amount. And auto, when it attacks, if the character facing this card is level 3 or higher, until end of turn, this card gets plus 4,500 power and the following ability. Auto, when this card's battle opponent comes reverse, you may put that character on the bottom of your opponent's deck. Oof. So this is good if your opponent has accelerated and gotten out 
one of their level threes early, which can be quite a common strategy to face. Uh, and then you get to tuck it into the bottom of their deck as well, which, depending on what you're facing, can be good or bad, but generally speaking, is bad. <laughs> so, secure a tree facing the blue sky is the climax from the back. So we have another snow halation. So you can make a nice snow halation theme here. Um, Beating Angel, Rin, Daughter of Dreams, Nico, uh, Kokoro Zawa, Unexpected Failure. This is a vent card. I uh, just wanted to point out this one because it's cost, uh, level two, costs two. And choose up two characters in your waiting room and return them to your hand. So that's just, it's a very simple, small ability, but salvaging two characters can be can make a huge difference. So we also have Frozen Nico. And then the rare for the pack. Another single rare. It's another Kira Kira sensation, but this time it's Nico. So it's another level zero, 500 power. Auto, put a climax from your hand into your waiting room as a cost. When this card is placed on stage from hand, you can pay that cost to search your deck for up to one character with change. Reveal it to your opponent, put it into your hand and shuffle your deck. So, changes um, a call ability. New club leader arises. So that's one of your stock filling um, blue climaxes. Yeah, change is a very useful ability to have. Um, gives you that extra early game pressure. So, and uh, uh, yeah, and I mean, uh, an Umi Harp. <laughs> alpaca. Oh, we got one of the Alpaca cards, that's cool. So, level zero, no cost. 1000 power, auto when this card is placed on the stage from hand, draw a card, choose a card in your hand, open it to your waiting room, uh, and the flavour text is just a question mark. <laughs> I love that card. <coughs> Stonelation Honoko, Unwavering Feelings, Super Idol Nico, so this is another event, so there's a lot of events here I'm noticing, um, not something you commonly see. If you do not have a character with Nico in its card name, this card cannot be played from your hand. Search your deck for up to one character with Nico in its card name, reveal it to your opponent, put it in your hand and shuffle your deck. So useless without Nico, incredibly useful with Nico. Snow Halation Hanio. And then we have a double R. Cool. So we have a double R Happy Maker Hanio. So continue with this card gets plus 1000 power for each of your other characters with Hanio in their card name. And also when this card is placed on the stage from your hand, draw up to two cards, choose a card in your hand and put it into your waiting room. So it's getting a buff by having, well, by doing what you were probably already doing with the deck, uh, and you get a nice little card draw from it. So consider that a success for a level three. And then our climax is memory that we were all here at this very moment. Oh, sweet. I feel I should watch this at some point. So we have Ooze Backup Dancer, Ellie. Huge Rice Ball. Door to our dreams, Hanukkah. The Glass Garden, Ellie. Door to our dreams, Hanio. No, this is one of the changes, actually, and it's a backup as well, which is interesting. The change is three stock and put a card from your hand into your waiting room and put this card into your waiting room. So at the beginning of your climax phase, you can pay the cost to choose a card named Snow Halation Hanio in your waiting room and put it onto the stage position that this card was on. So this is the cool change effect there. In a slump, Coterie. And then we have another single R, Forever and Ever, Coterie. So, level one, zero cost, 4,500 power. And if the number of other music characters you have is three or more, this card gets plus 1,000 power. So, 5,500, respectable amount for a level one. And Encore, put the top card of your deck into a clock, which is quite a painful Encore, but could be what you need to keep your field active. And then the answer that everyone decided. That's the climax. So most recently we've been playing the uh, Ken Collie with the new Second Fleet set. So um, that's sort of where my experience has been lately with Y shots. <laughs> so Snow Halation Ellie, Snow Halation Umi, Innocent Arissa, present for you, Mackie. The moment now is the best. Invitation from friends. There are a lot of events in this set. Another single R, Kira Kira Sensation, Nozomi. So it's a level two, costs one stock, 8,000 power. 
and when she's placed on the stage from hand, reveal the top card of your deck. If that's a music character, this card gets plus 2,000 power until end of turn. So the turn she comes into play, she's potentially a 10k. Oh, nap time, Mackie. She's potentially a 10k hitter, which allow her to go probably toe-to-toe -to -toe with a lot of level 3s as well, or just swamp over another level 2. Memories of Live Rin. Invitation to School Arena. Thought to our dreams and Zomi. Forceful Fact. Ah, so this is one of the Bond cards. So it bonds with Kirikiri Sensation and Hanukkah. Then we have Food Supplies before the live Mackie. Door to our dreams, Ellie. And another single rare. So it's another Sensation. This time it's Hanukkah. And she has backup and change as well. So she can change. Pay two, put a card from hand into the waiting room and put this card into your waiting room. And at the beginning of the climax phase, you may pay that cost to choose a card named Happy Maker Hanukkah in your waiting room and put it on stage this position this card was on. And then we also have another nap time, this one for Kutri. So, on to the next one. So we have another Snow Halation, Rin, Image Change, Hazomi. Uh, Nozomi. Did I say Hazomi? Sorry. Dressed up look. Mackey. Reawakened memories with everyone's strength, Rin. And we have a double R, which is Happy Maker Kotori Minami. So, a level 3, costs 2 to play, 10,000 power. Pay 1 stock when this card is placed on stage from hand to deal 1 damage to your opponent. Oof, that's nasty. And when another of your music characters is attacked, this card gets plus 1,000 power to the end of turn. So if you attack last, she's a 12,000 hitter. So that's cool. The egg, I always like being able to deal additional damage. Um, when the, sorry, when these 9 people are around was the climax card. But no, I always like doing that uh, extra additional damage as an effect on the level 3s. It just, it just, it's, it's satisfying. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have another Way of the Maiden. A Snailation Country. Full of smiles. Startling fact. Desperate emotions. Door to our dreams, Rin. And then, ah, we have another Rin. <laughs> so, it's level 0, 1,500. This ability activates up to one time per turn when you use an act. Choose one of your characters and that character gets plus 500 power to the end of turn. And then she has an act, which is a brainstorm. So it's pay one and rest the card. Reveal four cards from the top of the deck. Put them into your waiting room, but for each climax revealed, search your deck for up to one music character of each your opponent, put it in your hand and shuffle your deck. So you could potentially be tutoring out the key magic uh, music characters that you need. Uh, and at the same time you get to buff someone, so bonuses all round. Then we have unfulfilled wishes. Oh. Although they all look quite happy about that for some reason. So, if someone can explain that scene to me, that'd be great. So we have another heart Umi. Memories of life. Invitation to school. Present for you, Mackie. The glass garden, the Zomi. Love Wing Bow. And then the rare. Oh, it's a double rare, and it was the Happy Maker Nozomi. So it's another level three, costs two. If the number of your uh, if the number of other music characters you have is three or more, this card gets plus one thousand power. When this card is placed on the stage from your hand, you may put the top card of your clock into your waiting room, so it's got a heal effect. Always useful. An auto pay one stock when a card named Important Friends is placed on your climax area. If this card is in your centre stage, you can pay that cost to search your deck for up to one music character and put it into any position of your stage and shuffle, shuffle your deck. I think that's the fa my favourite of what I've seen so far. The damage was nice, the dealing with the damage, but um, being able to heal is always good. Um, Plus she gets a boost herself, so she becomes, so she's only nine and a half to start with, but she becomes ten and a half fairly easily. Uh, and that ability, I mean, um, it's a climax combo, but still, I, I like that. And then we have Secure Tree Facing the Blue Sky. No, I like that a lot. <laughs> that and Nozomi's my wife. Um, <laughs> Beating Angel Rin. Door to our dreams, snow halation, 
Another snow halation, but Nikkei this time. The morning of graduation. Door to our dreams. And then our rare is a Umi Kirikiri sensation. So level two, cost of a stock play, 8,000 power. When a card named Naptime Umi is placed on your climax area until end of turn, this card gets plus 3,000 power and the following ability. Auto, when this card's about the opponent comes reverse, you may put that character on the top of your opponent's deck. Oh, that's just, that's just cruel. <laughs> Very worth doing, though. And new club re leader arises. But yeah, putting cards back on top of your opponent's deck is just... Oh, it's so mean to do, but so worth it. <laughs> Door to our dreams, Hanukkah. Who's back up, Dancer. Invitation to school. The Glass Garden, Sightseeing Umi, Real Showdown Nico, and then we have the Forever and Ever Nozomi. So, level 2, cost 1 stock, 2500. All of your characters in front of this card get plus 1000 power. At the beginning of your main phase, look at the top card of your deck and put it on the top or bottom of your deck. That's an incredibly useful card. Incredibly useful. And full of energy, Guts Pose. Yeah! Let's try and open this one. Another Snow Halation Rin. Image Change. Another Snow Halation. <laughs> Unwavering Feelings. And gentle Smile at Umi. Golden Rice Temptation. And then we've got another single R, which is the Jump Row Penio. Level 1, 4500 for power. Two different abilities here, so continuous during your opponent's turn. This card gets plus 500 power for each of your other music characters. So, this could be, um, it's a good defensive wall. And then auto, pay two stock. When you play New Club Leader Arises in your Climax area, um, if you do search your deck for up to one level one or lower music character, put it into any position of your stage and shuffle your deck. So, second time we've seen this ability, it seems like it's going to be a bit of a a theme for them, which is cool, it's all good. Um, memory that we're all here at this very moment. So yeah, anything which gets them out, into, uh, gets characters out into the field is useful, so... Good for replacing losses. <laughs> um, we have another Snow Halation, an Alpaca, yay! Although I'm sure that artwork's different from the Japanese one. Snow Halation Ellie, uh, Snow Halation Maki, Daughter of Dreams, Mackie. Full stalling. Ooh, pretty. So we've got an SR forever and ever, Hania. So, level 1, 1500. Assist all of your other music characters in front of this card, get plus 1 level and plus 500 power. And also, when this card is placed on the stage from your hand, choose one of your characters with Hania. Um, have I been saying. No, I have been saying that right, I think, all the time. Oh, feel free to tell me in the comments how badly I have been mispronouncing these names. And that character gets plus 1,500 power until the end of turn. Um, even though it's just one big blue sky in the background, that SR printing is very pretty. It's very nice. So, pride and place so here. Oh, and then we got when these nine people are around. I'm going to shuffle stuff over slightly so we can have that on camera more. <laughs> SR, look at it. Beautiful. So, Invitation to School. Thought or Dreams of Zomi. Huge Rice Ball. Kokoroi Zoa. Tea Time. Keep up your fighting spirit. And a forever and ever Umi. So, very similar when this, um, sorry, um, level two, cost one stock, 5,000 power. When this card attacks, choose one of your other characters, and that character gets plus 1,500 power until the end of turn, so it's buffing the rest of your field, so swing early with this one. And auto, put a card from your hand into your waiting room. When this card is placed on stage from hand, you can pay that cost to choose a music character in your waiting room and return it to your hand, so you get a salvage effect on play as well. Naptime Kudri. So I thought it was like one of the other Forever and Evers, and then realised, uh, well, it's not. <laughs> Then we have Innocent Orissa, Memories of Leo, Invitation to School, Forceful Fact, Unexpected Failure, 
image change and then we have another forever and ever this time it's Ellie so level one cost one stock six thousand power if the number of other music characters you have is three or more she gets an additional thousand power so 7k um, level one that's that's an impressive number and encore put the top card of your clock deck into your clock so self damage in order to keep her around but at that power level that kind of might be worth it and then important friends <coughs> so we have a where the maiden memories of life invitation to school dressed up look Mackie super Ida Nico invitation from friends and then our rare Kiriko Sensation Mackie so level 1 5000 power and when this card is placed on the stage from your hand this card gets plus X power until end of turn X is equal to 500 multiplied by the number of characters you have with music so you've, you've got your field full of them um, that would be an additional two and a half thousand so yeah that's quite cool looking back at memories is the climax so pen ultimate back we've had an SR which is cool we'd still like to see uh, something else shiny in this though hopefully so another snow halation a present for you snow halation Mackie Dorto Dream Sanio Frozen Nico and then we have a double R that's cool happy maker Mackie so I can be happy with this <laughs> So, level 3, costs 2 stock, 10,000 power. During your opponent's turn, this card gets 500 power for each of your other music characters, so 12k in your opponent's turn, potentially. And when it's placed on stage from your hand, or by the change effect, you may put the top card of your clock into your waiting room, so you get to heal one as well when she's played. And then we have the answer that everyone decided. So, final pack time. We have Beaten Angel, Daughter of Dreams Nico, Kokura Yezua, Unwavering Feelings, Desperate Emotions, Inner Slump Kuturi, and then a uh, single R, but still at least it was early, so we can't complain too much. Level 2, 1 stock, 7,500 power. When this card is placed on stage from hand, she gets an additional 1,500 to the end of turn. So it becomes a 9k attacker at level 2. And when this card attacks, if a card named Looking Back at Memories is in your climax area, choose up to one music character in your waiting room, put it into your stock, and she gets an additional 3,000 power until end of turn. So that's enough to make most level 3s quake in their boots, that sort of power level. <laughs> Our last climax there was Unfulfilled Wishes. So that is an opening of Love Live Volume 2 School Idol project. Um, unfortunately, I don't know huge amounts about the set, uh, which is why we did sort of skim through a lot of the cards, because I just don't want to give you a badly informed opinion. Um, but it does appear that the set is mostly going to be supporting previous Love Live sets more than anything, especially the volume of event cards that are in here. Um, this is something I have noticed, there's a lot of events so if you're picking this up definitely look at trying to get a hold of the original love live set um but yeah otherwise i think it's pretty cool especially with um i think i like that you can either make yourself a pure waifu deck with your character of choice that's you know absolutely fine thing to do in this game um or you can go for you know having the entire band play so uh, the entire group performed together which is always cool I like having the option to choose which way you want to do it so yeah overall I think it's a good set from what I've seen um, I think it's going to be interesting to see what players make of it though those of you who are madly into Love Live I'd love to hear what you think about it um, please do let me know because I'd love to learn more about Y Schwartz and can only learn by learning um, <laughs> so yeah so there we go that is everything from this booster box so remember every card you've seen here today can be bought and sold on our website bigorbitcards.co.uk
Remember to like and subscribe, I'll be doing more unboxings later. Um, that's bye from me Simon and I'll see you next time. Bye.